Hey everyone, we are EECC Travels. I'm Elisa and this is Colby and Karen. And we have a different video today. So um, you, if you guys watch our channel, you know that we like to try foods from all over the world. And so when Munchpack contacted us and asked us if we wanted to try one of their snack boxes, we were like, of course, this is perfect for us because we like trying all these different foods. So what Munchpack is, it's a monthly subscription box and they will send you snacks from all over the world to try. So here's our box. Let's get it open and see what's inside. It's nippy. All right, so inside, this is what the box looks like inside. And so there's a note in the top of the box, and some notes inside. And let's see what we've got here. It says, download the Munch Pack Snack Scanner. View your history, scan the barcode, save your favorites. That's cool. So you can scan the barcode on each of these snacks and and get information on them. It is available on the App Store and Google Play. So we also have a note from Munch Pack and it says, Hi, Elisa and Jason. And um, this is just information on Munch Pack. Oh, and they want to sh us to share with you a special promo code. So if you guys like this and want to give it a try, you can use promo code EECC Travels for a discount. And I'll put a link down in the description um, with this link and this promo code if you want to give it's, it a try. It's um, three dollars off, and it, the extended time is for a year, exactly yes. a year. Okay, and this box was made by Nick. Yay. So he's the one that packed this box. Thanks, Thanks Nick. Nick. Thanks, Nick. Okay, so here what? is the inside with all the snacks. <laughs> all right. So we've got Jap Ooh. Japanese. Oh no! Pickle Rick. <laughs> okay, hold on. We got oh. <laughs> some pickle Rick. <laughs> we got a little overexcitement here. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> do that voice. <laughs> We got a little overexcitement. Let's just bring it down a little bit. All right, so we're gonna go one snack at a time. So this looks like Doritos, Japanese, but Chinese. It's all in a different language. And let's see. You see it? Okay, so yeah, there is a sticker on here that Americanizes this for us. This is Doritos Grilled Barbecue Flavor, but this packaging is from Israel. Israel. All right, so this is what it looks like. And yeah, all the all the wording, everything on here is definitely in a language we can't read. All right. Definitely. Yeah. All right. Grilled mm. barbecue flavor. Mm. Those are different. That's not like any Doritos I've ever had before. Yeah. And the chips seem a little mm. bit thinner, don't they? Aftertaste. Mm, I don't like it. You don't like it? D Wait till the aftertaste. They're not bad. Oh. <laughs> so okay. Col aftertaste. Colby doesn't like them. Do you like them? I like the aftertaste. You like the aftertaste? They're they're different. Yeah, it's definitely a, a barbecue flavor, but it's not like the barbecue chips that we're used to. So, here we go. Alright, next up, let's stick with all the savory first. Here we have, there's the packaging. And this says, Deliciotos, and I'm probably saying that wrong. Probably this very... is a delicious pepper snack, crunchy mm. puffed snack bites, and this is from Brazil. I don't like spicy food. I'm probably gonna regret this. Mm. <laughs> oh, really? Let me give it a whiff. <laughs> <laughs> Yeet. Oh, definitely pepper. Oh. That's pepper. Whoa, that's pepper. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. It's not good. Crunchy puffed snack bites, yeah. So that's exactly what they are. These they're these little puffy. It looks like uh, Captain Crunch cereal is what it looks like, but it definitely doesn't taste like Captain Crunch. No, I think they're good. Tastes like garbage. Yeah, they're good. These are definitely different. They're pepper. All right. He's eating that barbecue chip. All right. 
we have Rick and Morty Pickle Rick. <laughs> yeah, a Rick and Morty Pickle Rick. From she has no idea what this is. No, yeah. I don't know what this is. It's, it's a giant is. dill pickle. Just mine. It is a Pickle Rick in a pouch, and this is from America. Of but course. It it's is. From um, okay, we're going to need a bowl. <laughs> All right, this is mine. Mm -hmm. This is just a normal pickle, but I'm gonna eat it. We'll it's open mine. this last. It okay, is that's gonna mine. be a bit messy. It's gonna be a good tasty Ooh, burger. We have a drink. Alright, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Okay, this looks interesting. Hold on. Don't don't okay. say don't say anything. I'm gonna go get some cups. Okay, so we have this bottle of drink here, and you can look, definitely tell by the packaging it's from Japan. I could tell that before even reading the title. But it is a Poco Sapporo. Melon, Melon cream, cream soda. soda from Japan. So let's give this a try. Mmm, tasty. Pour it in the cups first. Oh, it, what does that remind you of? Wait, let me smell. Okay, if you've been to Epcot and you've been to Club Cool, the melon soda from Club Cool is exactly what this smells like. It tastes like something different. It smells like something like cotton candy. Yeet. It is a really thick green. Mm. Delicious. Cheers. Thumbs up. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Ooh. That's good. That's very good. He's over here whispering. That's very good. <laughs> it's very sweet. Mm. I like that. <laughs> He's getting warm. Okay, so everything else in the box is <laughs> sweet. <laughs> Look at them. Okay, everything else in the box is sweet. So we did our savory. We've got a little palate cleanser in our drink here. And now we're going to move on to the sweet stuff. So we have next sour power straws. I don't think that's sweet. Watermelon flavor. And these are from the Netherlands. Okay, where my little safety scissors go. Oh, here's mine though. Oh, my cup's on you. One sour straw for you. One sour straw for you. Well, oh, it's just that's not a straw. Inside. So it's like a Twizzler coat it in sugar. I don't know what these are. Mm. Mm. Definitely sour. It'll be a baby. <laughs> oh my god. It's sour. <laughs> Y'all think it's sour? <laughs> you got a sour face. Those are sour. Wow. But what I do like about them is the coating of sugar. So you've got that sweet and sour, and they're really good. And the watermelon flavor is good, too. So which one of y'all are going to want these? It's hard to chew. <laughs> Majority of this is going to me. Cameron's going to eat everything. Mostly this. And the giant pickle. Okay. The, pickles. the next thing that we have are cannoli chips. Okay. So these are powdered sugar flavored cannoli chips and they are made in the United States. Yeah. So it says crunchy and sweet cannoli chips coated with powdered sugar. This looks good something messy. right up my alley. Good, good, good. Ooh, these, are, these are really good. I like them. Mm. Smell it. Mmm, smells nice. Mm. Here. Finger ring. One Lick for it. you. One for you. Finger ring. Lick it. Mm. These are good. That's nice. Hold on. Tastes like a funnel cake. Yeah, it kind of does. It tastes like a funnel cake in, in chip form. Mm. Mm. So These are a hit. 10 out of 10. Mm. 10 out of 10? Mm. Out of 10? Mm. All right, That's so this good. is our That's favorite good. thing so far. Mm. Okay. Well. Tastes nice. <laughs> Except the pickle. Okay, mm. next, we have Choco Picks. Oh, they look like Pockies. Okay. They, yeah, they kind of do remind us of Pockies. All right, these are from South Korea, and it says Cocoa Pick Biscuits. So, yeah, that is kind of like a Pocky stick. We've, we've had Pocky before. Crunchy yeah. biscuit sticks with it's dipping nice. chocolate and sprinkles. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Schmilly. Okay, so, let's see if I can Learn. show you the inside. Without spilling all the sprinkles. Thing. Without spilling, I'm trying not to spill the sprinkles. Okay, okay nice. so you have... Sticks. This the breadsticks. Yeet. 
And then you have the chocolate. And then you dip it in the sprinkles. Look at that! Okay, that one's for you. Yeet! You wanna do your own? Dip it in the chocolate. <laughs> and then dip it in the sprinkles. Smell it. Mm, okay, it I have nice. to try one of these too. Ooh. How was that? No, I wish it was done the bit with like. Okay, got my chocolate. Got my sprinkles. Cheers. <laughs> oh, you are. Mmm. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> double dip. <laughs> We're family. We can double dip. We're sharing. Okay, so yeah, this is a hit too. Bread, Cheers. This bread is, good. is good. Who would have thought breadsticks and chocolate go together, but they really do. This is tasty. Ooh. I like that. Okay. This is nice. <laughs> so these are a hit from South Korea. Yeet. <laughs> okay, <laughs> next we have Chew It. Oh. Okay, let's see if you can see this. Cola flavor. These are cola flavored Chew It's from the United Kingdom. Okay, so these were uh, a challenge to open. So these are like little soft chews. And here, here's one for you all. Oh, we love cola. Yeah. And they're, yeah, they smell like cola too. Schmilly. Cola family. Family. Mm, and one for so you all. On my wrapper. Breaks. And one for me. <laughs> Crazy sniffing my going on pops. here. All right, so let's try our cola flavored chewits. Now, what's funny though is they're pink. They, they look like gum. They look like apricot. Actually, you know what they look like? They look like gum paste. So they're pink. They're like squishy. a pink, squishy, chewy. Squishy and soft. I'm trying to make a man. Here's my man. I don't really get a Coca-Cola taste. Do you get cola? You get I a little cola? I do, in fact, taste cola. Mm -hmm. But I don't taste Coca-Cola. It feels, it tastes like, it doesn't taste like Pepsi or Coke. It tastes like it's in between. It tastes like a flavored cola to me. It tastes like, like a cherry cola. It tastes like cherry Coke. I don't taste it. It tastes like both, both the colas <laughs> intermixed with each other. Splitting the atoms <laughs> together just to make it one little chewy. Well, I think they taste like cherry coke. They're good. They are. They're they're sticky. <laughs> I made but a they're good. I made a person. Okay, we Hope have stuff. three snacks left and a pickle. All right. So here are Amori cookies. Amori. So these look like kind of Oreos. But these are from Brazil. They're white chocolate sandwich cookies. Mmm. <laughs> okay, white chocolate sandwich cookies, okay? So, just your regular sandwich cookie, and then it's got a center. Okay, you try that one. I'm gonna go get a cup of milk. I'm just kidding. And one for you. And one for me. Smell it. Cheers. Mmm, it smells Ooh. nice. Yeah, it smells like white chocolate. Actually... Smells like sweet, sweet vanilla. Mmm. That's good. Mouth is dry. Those are good. I don't think they're gonna go with melon soda. You think they're gonna go with melon soda? Probably not. <laughs> He's gonna eat it like that anyway. But yeah, I'm these are good. Okay, so these are these are a plus. Amori sandwich cookies from Brazil. All right, we're almost done. Okay, so these are fudge classic, soft and delicate. Not bad. <laughs> it says milk cream fudge, soft and chewy fudge with creamy center. These are from Poland. Okay, so this feels different. It's like candy. I thought it was gonna be a cookie, yeah, but good. this is candy. You can tell by the picture. I thought it was a big old butter. Ooh, and they're individually wrapped in here. So one for you, and one for you, and one for mom. And these, and they say, 
<laughs> Cameron and his loud sniffing is hilarious. Schmilly. All right, so, ooh, they're sticky. All right, so you open them up, and it's kind of, um, oh, it smells good. It's like a Tootsie Roll, but fudge, I'm not a fan. Oh. Oh mm. my God. Our Tootsie Rolls. Oh, that was so easy okay. to bite into. So you're expecting Tootsie Rolls, so you're expecting to be thick, soft. but it's so soft. Mmm. Mm. Crushing my fingers. And you just bite right through it. This tastes like praline to me. So if you've been to Louisiana, you've been to New Orleans, and you've had pecan pralines before, that's what this tastes like. It's basically it's like a delicious sugar concoction. This is delicious. I'm going to check this bottle. No. Thing my mother has been waiting for. Mm. Okay. I saved what I thought would be my favorite for last. And it is this. Strawberry wafer cookie. It's called Rip Van Waffles. Strawberry flavored. And it's from Canada. So Canada, this. Huh? Oh my gosh. Y'all are so funny. <laughs> Mm. Okay, so this is just one solid piece, so we're going to break pieces off for everybody. Don't give me that big. Ooh. Give me a big piece. I want my It's ooey gooey on the inside. Very thin. Yeah, so it's almost like a caramel on the inside that's holding it together. Mmm. That's good. I'm not getting really a strawberry flavor of it. Me Maybe very, very slight, but it's on very this. good. It could all be in the center. Mm. But it is very, very good. I taste it. So all right. My lack of manners. Last up is pickle. Okay, so we have opened the pickle. This is the Rick and Morty. What is it called again? Pickle Rick. Pickle Rick. Okay, so Cameron was nice enough to cut a small, small piece off for me and Colby because he's claimed Still too much. this pickle for himself. <laughs> so, okay, give the pickles a try. <laughs> he's making a mess. How's the pickle? It's like a pickle. <laughs> it's a pickle, but what's real? It's a cool packaging. It's something that they know what Rick and Morty is. I don't know what Rick season and Morty three. Is. Okay, anyway, so it's a good pickle. Here you can have my piece of pickle. <laughs> it's an extra salty pickle. Cameron loves pickles. Cameron loves pickles so much that whenever the pickles are all gone out of the jar, he takes the pickle juice and puts it in these little containers and freezes it and makes pickle pops. So let me tell you, when we opened this box and he saw a dill pickle in there, were you happy? <laughs> so if you like this idea and you want to try a munch pack for your for yourself, it's munchpack.com and use promo code EECC Travels for $3 off your first box. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to our channel, please subscribe for more videos to come. And until next time, bye. I'm Pickle Rick. <laughs> bye.